Hey everybody, this is Kristen and I have our November uh, Cat and Cuts box today. And I'm super, super excited to see what they have. Um, when I looked at the uh, options or the, the sneak peek that Debbie sent me, there's some really, really fun fabrics. Um, so I'm going to open this up since I'm so excited. And for those of you who don't know, Cotton Cuts is a subscription box that sends you fabric. That's all they send you, and it's actually curated for you. So, beautiful logo that I love so much. And uh, I'm really excited to see what my enthusiast Debbie picked out for me this month. Alright. Believe you can, and you are halfway there. That is my inspirational slogan for this month. This month, uh, my box was packed by Kim. She included some florals, which is Twilight by One Canoe Two for Moda Fabrics, Holiday Seasonal, which is A Walk in the Woods by Whistler Studios for Wyndham, some blenders, Road Trip by Allison Glass for Andover Fabrics, and uh, I got some CC Vaults, which in this case, um, is a couple of things that came from Quilt Market, or, um, is it Quilt Market? I don't remember, but the big quilting festival that they just had, I think it was in Houston, and Cotton Cuts brought back a few Fat Quarter bundles, and a few of us, um, were lucky enough to get stuff, so I have Berry Season, and, um, which is an Elizabeth Hartman, and a Dot Fabric, I'm not sure who the maker is, but super excited to see what that is. Um, our designer spotlight is Christine Weld, and as always, I'll put all of that down in the comments below, or in the description box below, so you don't have to try to pause and read it on my screen. And we always get our choice of um, one of the included quilts, so this is something that Christine Weld has created, and we get a um, coupon code, essentially, to get it for free as part of our subscription box. And the block of the month is the spool. So what Cotton Cuts does is they have a coloring thing on the back. And if you color it and post it on Instagram um, and maybe even other social media, it's hashtag CC color challenge and you could win two yards of fabric. And guys, it's they actually do giveaways and actually give away fabric. Um, I hashtag CC feature Friday and uh, they sent me a half yard of really pretty fabric. So this is Big Sky, I think it's a Moda line, um, but they do send you fabric if you win, so definitely check it out. <sighs> All right, let's get into my box. So there's my beautiful box, and I am already so excited because I can see some of the things that I love ever so much in here. So if I can get my little uh, pink ribbon out of the way. I hate cutting these because I actually use them because they're so pretty. All right, here we go. Which end to start with? I'm gonna start with this really, really pretty green. So if I'm not mistaken, this is gonna be an Allison Glass fabric. And it's this beautiful like hunter green, um, yeah, Road Trip by Allison Glass. It's a beautiful hunter green with blue flowers and kind of a lighter green and a yellow. Let's see if you can see that okay um, for the leaves. So really pretty small print floral. Loving that. Oh, this is fun and bright. All right. So it looks like there's trees on here. Um, Eiffel Tower would be my guess. So nice and bright and fun, and how amazing would this be for like a um, a fussy cut? It would be so, so pretty. I love all the colors and just, it's beautiful, I love it. And a really pretty um, dense green with blue, some olive, and some um, mustardy shade in there. So... Again, really pretty. All this is going to be that Alice in Glass road trip fabric. Then we have some of my florals, which is Twilight by One Canoe Two. And these are just really delicate, feminine. Uh, it's white with this really beautiful um, 
almost dusky blue and just really pale, delicate, um, peachy florals. There you go, that's a better version. So really pretty. I have no idea what I'm going to do with this, but I think this is going to be one of those fabrics that I kind of hoard and, and hold on to until I have the right thing. And this is the same fabric, but with a different color. So it's a peach background this time and a really pretty um, gray-blue flower. It almost has a hint of purple in there too. Super pretty. And let's see. I'm not sure this might be um, the holiday seasonal fabric, which is a walk in the woods for Wyndham. And you can see there's like little birdies and flowers and um, some sort of red. I'm not sure if those are berries or flowers, but it's pretty. And it's on kind of a, a really pale pink, pale peach background. I don't know if you can see that. It kind of looks more yellow in my display right now, but it's a, it's a pink. And then... <laughs> oh, this is fun, guys! Look at this. So it's a holiday woods. You have a little bear with a scarf. And there's a deer. And let's see if it's on this side or not. Yeah, there's like some little um, mushrooms. Oops. And I've got fox and squirrels on this side. Oh, this is so much fun. Maybe I'll make a bag or something out of this. I, I hate to cut this fabric. Oh, it's so cute. Oh, hey, there's Mrs. Bear on here too. It's not just one, it's two bears. And look, guys. There's a hedgehog! Oh, it's so cute! Okay, enough gushing about this fabric. I love it though, it's really fun. This, this is what I was crushing on hardcore. Look at how stinking cute. Little toadstools or mushrooms or whatever you want to call it. It is freaking adorable. Love it. I love Elizabeth Hartman though. Really, really loved her last line, so I'm excited to have some of this line too. Um, just really kind of delicate flowers. It reminds me a lot um, of there were some flowers in like her Arctic line that I liked. So it reminds me a lot of that. Um, and the line I was talking about earlier was uh, Terrarium, I think it was called. But that one was really cool too. Some really cute um, dots to go with it. I have a, a nice deep, more of a burgundy color with white and again a nice kind of evergreen Christmas tree shade green with some white and uh, a nice pop of lightness which is almost this like butter yellow with little X's all over it so really really pretty I love it thank you Debbie for putting this line in my box <laughs> you have no excited huh? no <laughs> I'm getting so excited. I'm talking faster than my mouth can speak. If that actually means anything. I'm really excited to have this. Um, I was really hoping I'd have one. So to have multiples of this line. And I'm just over the moon. Thank you. Um, yeah, I, I love my box. Honestly, you know, this, this fabric is adorable. I don't remember seeing it, but maybe I missed it. Or I only saw like, you know, one of those little tiny boxes and it just had a piece of it. But this is super fun. Probably my favorite surprise other than my berry season uh, fabrics. This was really fun. And I, of course, I love the Alice in Glass stuff. I love, love, love her fabrics. So it was a great box this month. Um, as always, I'm super happy with Cotton Cuts. Um, you know, it might take you a little bit to get into a groove with your enthusiast. But once you do, I mean, honestly, I, I've been really loving it. And I I love the relationship that, you know, I've, you feel like you can have with your enthusiast and, and Kim. And it's a, it's a great program. So if you haven't checked them out yet, definitely do that. Uh, there's a code for 10% off if you use my code, Ranger Kristen, and um, I get $5 off of my box. So it's a great win-win. And... Um, it really, what they do, you know, 
the, the proceeds go to help kids in need. They have a, a heart builders program and it actually, um, when you're when you're buying from Cotton Cuts, you're actually em helping employ um, adults with special needs as well. So those two things um, really make me happy to be a part of the Cotton Cuts family. So time out, everybody! I was so excited about all of my fabric that I completely forgot to mention what the um, little something extra, the lanyap, is for my Cotton Cuts box this month, and. <laughs> I'm sorry, I like I said, I just got too excited and went wee to fabric, and I didn't realize that until I started editing this video, hence all of this. Uh, but this month we have soak wash, and it says gently launder your new creations and enjoy. So I have scentless and lacy material girl. So I got these two different washes. And it sounds like it's a um, rinse-free, environmentally friendly form, uh, formulation. Perfect for washing lingerie, sweaters, swimwear, handmade quilts, and baby clothes, etc. So, cool. Made with plant-derived and renewable ingredients. So, that's cool. And uh, I'm going to try these out. It looks like it would be good for um, smaller things like uh, wall hangings and things like that because it mentions um, hand washing with a teaspoon in one gallon of water, soaking it, squeezing it, that sort of thing. So this will be fun to try. Anyways, go ahead, hit subscribe, hit the like button, comment below what did you like about my fabric this month, um, and hit the notifications so you never miss a video. And I will see you guys next month, and hopefully I actually remember to talk about everything in my box. All right, bye guys.